Hey, are you new to the club? Click the subscribe button and don't forget to click the notification bell beside it. See ya. What's up everyone and welcome to Spiller Kenzie channel and on this video we'll be having a quick tutorial on how to sideload apps on your Oculus Quest. SideQuest is one of the essential apps that you need for your Oculus Quest. For example, if you want to have custom songs to your Beat Saber game, you need BMBF and you can only install this BMPF using SideQuest or using native ADB. But for this video, we will only focus on SideQuest. To download SideQuest, visit SideQuestVR.com and download the installer file or DMG file. I'll be using Mac for this tutorial and it's pretty the same as a Windows machine. For Mac, you need to open the DMG file and drag the application folder or the application to the application folder. And that's it. We're done. And SideQuest is now installed on your Mac. But we're not done yet. Next is to set your Oculus Quest to a developer mode. For Quest, to turn on the developer mode, you need to open your Oculus Mobile and click the more settings. But before you enable it, Oculus requires a developer account setup. Facebook requires more information from you like credit card and such before you create an organization. And once you add an, an organization, you can now toggle the developer settings on your Oculus Mobile. Okay, now let's start using SideQuest along with our Oculus VR headset. You need your charging cable plugged into your Quest headset and your Mac or PC. After this, a pop-up will appear on your VR headset and asking permission to allow USB debug mode. For this, top click or allow. You will see on your SideQuest app if you're connected properly if it is showing the green indicator in the upper left area of the SideQuest app. And we're done. Now we need to test if side loading or installing APK file will work on our Quest 2 VR headset. To install an APK, you need to get it from somewhere like APK Pure or APK Mirror. After downloading the APK, all you need to do is to drag and drop the file to the SideQuest app. And that's it. If you want to see the progress, you can check the Task tab and you will see if it's, if it's green or not. And that's pretty much it. Setting up SideQuest is not that hard. And then if you have any questions, please don't hesitate to put a comment below. And I'm glad to help. The next video is how to add custom songs or level on your Beat Saver game on Quest 2. So please don't forget to click the subscribe and the like button.